Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Tales of Asperia. Let's see where this uh, pathway leads us now. Hi, kitty. Let's go ahead and fight you. Golden opportunity. Our strategy worked. Took me a little while to get that uh, Thunder Moon off, jeez. Alright, you're dead. Now on to you. I ended up uh, having to run back to the save point and end it because I had to end the uh, recording session. So uh, we did at least get some healing. Uh, of course, I'm just now realizing that I don't have my documents up. There we go. I uh, probably don't want to do that yet. Three special gels. What do they do again? All hit points and TP. Uh, so let's go ahead and use two of them. There we go. This will make good practice. Hello. I like that one that was just like, hmm. I, I think she, she's around there somewhere. I'll, I'll try to hit her. Ah, rude. Steel defense. Uh, still working on Vitality 4 and Overlimit Plus, alright. Well, let's see where this goes. Oh, hey! Wait. That was an odd place to put me, alright. Meteorite Blade, a sword made out of meteorite metals. Legend has it that the sword fell from the skies. And that opens. The Blastia Freight Lift has been unlocked. Does that mean all of them? Super Chain 2 and Combination 3. Alright, well, he's got some stuff to uh, learn when he's done with that weapon. Alright, that's not one. Let's see where this one leads. Oh. Well, that is uh, quite a few different places. Um... <laughs> See where exactly it takes us. If there's anything new that we uh, couldn't get before, doesn't look like it. Yeah, this is all places that we've been. <clears throat> I 
Keep going all the way up. The question is whether they've all been, uh, opened. Where does seven go? I don't think we've, uh, gone to seven. Oh! Hey! Would you look at who that is over there? Let's go back down to level one. Don't mind us! We'll be with you shortly. I want to check to see if the one on the other side has been uh, activated. Don't mind me. No, no it is not. Okay. It's good to know. Let us go to six then. Um, well, it looks like we might be going to uh, the final boss now. Let's just uh, double check. Yeah, that's still uh, still locked. That probably goes to the other one. I'm guessing that those are not uh, perfectly straight uh, shafts, huh? Get a save. Up the stairs we go. This is a really, really long staircase. And of course the game won't let me jump down it, will it? Whoops. Didn't actually mean to go up the stairs. That almost looked like we were on an escalator. Oh, I'm pretty sure the other one was uh, not working anyway. Duke! Averl! Duke, we have the four elemental spirits. Their power can counter the Autophagos. Well, that may be, but I want to murder all humans now. So, uh, it doesn't matter whether you have another solution. There's no need to use people to destroy the Autophagos. But I want to! Look at its size. Four spirits are nothing against it. Uh, I mean, you say that. They're crucial. We'll make up the rest by turning the Blastia cores to spirits, too. Every single core in the world! And as a bonus, it'll put an end to the Blastia culture that you hate so much. Not too shabby, huh? I doubt humans will hand over their Blastia quietly. Or will you force them? Well, I mean, we're here, and, um, they're not here. There's not a whole lot that they can do to stop us. We don't force anyone to do anything. Can you not believe that people can move forward and change? Mm, I don't think he does. Humans will not let something go once it is in their grasp. Plenty of them do. So you won't listen. We will destroy the Autophagos our own way. Please! Wait just a little longer. The people are determined as we are determined. We won't let that go to waste. And will the world return to its former state? Probably should have uh, changed my party makeup, shouldn't I have? Huh? Will the air be controlled by the Entelikea? Will all life return to a time when nature ruled? No. You are changing this world. Our Terka Lumeres. For what? I, I mean, a little thing called saving it. You ever thought of that? For the convenience of humans. Nothing <laughs> more. Are you implying that the Autophagos is not a threat to every living thing on the planet? Can't you think that the world might be growing? 
I think of the Entelikea becoming spirits as evolution. Can't you see that? I would not presume to speak on the choices of the Entelikea. However, I also have my choices. Okay. Um, let's fight so we can kill you and uh, do what we came here to do. So you won't listen to us because we're humans? You say you can't trust people, so you just drop everything. Then when it's too late, you try to wipe them out? Do you know what this tower is? A really annoying place to get through, yeah. Tarkaron was once a city, but the ancients turned it into a weapon to destroy the Antilochia. <sighs> to the ancients who did not recognize the threat of the Blastia, the Antilochia who attacked the Blastia were nothing more than a nuisance. And the air went out of balance, and the Autophagos appeared. I mean, I, I feel like this uh, could have been solved with uh, some talking. Only then did humans listen to the words of the Entelikea. I mean, if the Entelikea were attacking them, then uh, were the Entelikea really talking to them in the first place? Our world has seen many sacrifices, yet humans committed the same offense, and they will again. Well, if all of the uh, Entelikea have turned into spirits, and we've turned all the Blastia cores into spirits, uh, then there isn't exactly any way for them to do it. Now, can they? Those who eat away and ruin this world. Those who would change the world for their own continued existence. They are apostles of destruction greater than even the Atafagos. Is that the reason you're trying to destroy humanity? I made a vow to my friend that I would protect this world. Yeah, that, that means, like, saving what's in the world, too, which includes humans. Lucifer. So Chroma told you. Yeah, she also told us to stop you. She listened to us, too, and became a spirit. So please, we can do this together. Enough. If the Entelikea would throw away their mission, then I will take it up. Well, that is incredibly arrogant to think that they've thrown the mission away by becoming something different. I need not wait for your method. Once I complete this formula, the world will be saved. Duke, stop! What's the point of a saved world if there's nothing on it to live? As long as humans rule, they will commit the same offense time and again. That's probably true. If that happens, their hearts will grow wild, and the future will be even more painful. Even if that happens, it's the path we choose. Even if we are hurt or stopped, we can still walk again as long as we don't give up. Yeah, unless, of course, our legs have been destroyed. She's right. You'll never find anything new if you're afraid of making mistakes, of failing. And unlike you, we haven't chosen this path on our own. Everyone decided on it. Yeah, going it alone might be tough, but we're not alone. If one person can't do it, then we do it together. I finally learned that we can walk together like that. I. Eventually, you'll hit a dead end with the solutions you come up with alone. But if everyone takes a force together, no wind nor rain can stop you crossing the ocean. That may be sufficient for those who are connected to one another. However, there will always be some who cannot accept a difficult future. You all surely understand that. It will be difficult, but that is reality. They will take what changes, think, and change again. Both the people and the world. Let me just look at Judith. She stopped trying to destroy all the Blastia. So even if it takes tens, hundreds of years, they will listen someday. I know this now. That's what it means to live. Change is painful. But fearing it means we never make any progress. And we'll be there to support those who need it. That's why knights exist. Why guilds exist. Right. There are things you have to protect. But this old man wants to see what lies ahead for people in the next era. Uh, of course he won't, because his uh, Blastia heart is going to uh, turn into a spirit. See how the fools change for those who can't see them anymore. I just don't get it. We started from the same place. 
I do not understand it either. One would think we would also strive for the same future. Why, Why must we are fight? <sighs> so, you don't even see yourself in the future you envision. Well, I mean, he is human, and if he plans to wipe out all humans... My existence as well may one day bring ruin to this world. But you're working really hard on getting to that point already. How nice of you to sacrifice yourself. When did he pick Enough. that up? Come. Okay, we're coming. Oh, well, now that's not fair. You're floating. And this is not the party that I would have taken if I had really thought about it. Well, we'll see if we can uh, succeed. Uh, he only has 286,000 hit points. 4,000 TP. He does float. There is no secret mission for this point. Let's go ahead and do that. Ow! Rude. This isn't a path we chose alone. The Entelechaea, the Critia, they've chosen the same path. I have no reason to go along with your plan. I have newfound hope and conviction. We have to bring that hope into reality. The Entelechaea will regret that decision, and humans will wish they had died. I won't regret it, no matter what you say, even if it means fighting for our lives. Such a foolish conclusion. Ow! There is no longer any point in talking. I wish we could have come to an understanding. I guess we can't change you. No more. Kill myself. Um, eh, I've done a little bit of damage. Honestly, I, 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 I kind of suspect that. Yeah, I kind of suspect that uh, uh, <laughs> Estelle is doing the most damage so far. Ooh. That works. Get your... Stop moving around. Uh, for some reason, my wrist is hurting. Oh. I think I'll stay away from you. <laughs> oh, now that is cheating. Ow! Oh, poop. There we go, got dispelled. Uh, what are you at now? 134, all right. Yes, I do, actually. Because this form, at least, is not all that difficult. It's down to 51,000 hit points. Yeah, actually, I'm pretty sure we will. Uh, it works better if I am not <laughs> halfway across the map when, you, when I do a thing. There we go. Now I know what Pharaoh 
saw in you. That's 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 great. Are you gonna give up now? You're you're not, are you? Ah, I have to defeat him now with a mystic art. You're pretty strong yourself. How can someone be so strong? He really isn't all that strong. Even when they've decided to give up their life for the world. This is most definitely not the hardest fight. That was most definitely not the hardest fight that we have had. My feelings for this world give me strength. You actually want to live. You want to keep those feelings alive. <laughs> I also promised a fallen friend to return this world to its natural state. And I would die to fulfill my promise. My friend, grant me your strength! Oh, hey, of course he has gone into, uh, angelic mode. Spirit. But, I think we're gonna have to, uh, face him next time. See you then, everyone.